Hey guys, welcome to the Steel Donut. My name is Connor. Joining me today is Matt. Hey, what's up? I'm Matt. Do 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 do. Bob. Baby. Hey. And Blake. Hello. And Hello. If there's one topic you probably shouldn't write fan fiction for, it's probably 9/11. Stop writing 9/11 stories. Actually, yeah. Everyone. Uh, actually, a. Uh, uh, a better piece of advice would be don't write fan fiction. <laughs> Fine, yeah. but if you're gonna but write fan fiction, don't write it about 9-11. 9-11 is a real-life tragedy. That, that is affected. fresh in the memories of many people. And so fictional characters are probably not yeah, especially a good way to express anything. Don't write, yeah. don't write a fan fiction if your friend just died. Don't write a fan fiction for 9-11. Don't write it for Benghazi. I don't give a shit. Don't write it for the... Harambe. The, 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Harambe fan fiction. Harambe. It probably exists. But, <laughs> probably but uh, yeah. I'll, I'll add that the worst part about them is they're, they're not even written with any sort of... Or, of Tact. And this, you know what, this, I, I'd say this goes beyond just fan fiction. I can't tell you how many, like, comic books did, in fact, exactly the same thing the fanfic writers do, where the villains show up and they're like, this is too evil, even for us, when it's not. The villains are killers. The fact that this happened in real life is the only thing that makes it more shocking than the fictional murders that the villains perform in the comics. And for yeah. case in point, for our yeah. 9-11 special, we have a story here called 9-11. <laughs> it, and the description it's in the of Power Rangers story. It's a tragedy a romance. Rangers. Romance. I... <laughs> yeah. It's a power. It's a Power Ranger. a story of romance. It's a Power Ranger story. The description reads: Jaden's upset because of nine eleven. Uh, you know what? <laughs> oh, I'm. God. I'm upset because of the story nine eleven as well. Yeah. He thinks everyone should remember it. We You'll do. You'll be upset Trust because me. of nine eleven by the end of this video as well. Crazy kiss. Crazy Chris, the person who wrote the story, <laughs> I shit you not. We remember it. We don't need you to remind us of 9-11. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, Twelve years after it happened, might I add. <laughs> we picked this uh, story not just because of the topic. Oh, no, this isn't the only 9-11 remembrance fan fiction, but uh, because of the content. So let's yeah. jump right in We've had with Jaden's POV. I woke up to a sun shining in my face. Oh, it's like right there. Just, Good like, job. Just, just, I got like, oh, sleeping outdoors. How, can I, I can I make a, can I make a slight addendum to our warning right at the beginning? I know we spent a lot of time on this, but if you're gonna write a 9/11 story, don't make it shit. <laughs> also, um, to, to uh, sort of lighten the mood here, I woke up to a sun shining in my face. It may seem like a small <laughs> thing, but. Small things can make a big difference. There's a difference between the sun shining on your face and in your no, face. It makes it yeah, sound like the sun's about five well, feet away. Oh, oh, hold on. Uh, coming up is a not-so-small issue. I looked at the clock. I knew what day it was. September 11th. Oh, no, yes. actually it says, I knew what day it colon September 11th. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I knew that what day it, it September 11th. Yeah. It was my mother's birthday. I always think of her. She died in 9-11. Whoa. Oh. Now that's not a great it, birthday <laughs> present. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> birthday death day. Right there. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Thanks for going there with me, Connor, because I, I was afraid I'd be didn't up Didn't Death Clock have a song <laughs> called that? <laughs> uh, probably. Uh, yeah, yeah. Birthday death day. I'm trying to think of a uh, joke. I can't think of one. It was her 24th birthday, and she died at 3.31 in New York City. I got out of bed and went to my bathroom to shower, get dressed, and brush my teeth. I was so sad about my mom, I did my morning routine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, 7.30, shit, shower, and shave. At the same 30 seconds time. 8.30, <laughs> cry for my mom. I plopped down on my bed. Tears ran down my cheek. How do you fucking... <laughs> I sniffled. Someone ran in my room, screaming. What Some an asshole. Time. I jumped and turned around to find it was Mike. He started laughing. What a prick. He topped, he topped laughing and looked at me. <laughs> what the fuck? 
fuck does that mean? <laughs> he topped it. He so, topped off his laughing. They missed the that S off right there. They missed yeah. the S on stopped. Yeah. I thought they missed an L for toppled. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't make sense. That's why I was confused. Yeah. Scared ya, huh? I took off my shoe and threw it at his chest. Wow. He started running. I got up and ran outside my room and threw my other one, which hit him in his butt. <laughs> God. Why did I have my shoes on? I was in my That's room. Why did he say, have like, a sh- he, like, he, like, he, he, he just wears his shoes all the time. He likes to break them in, so he wears them to the bed, thing is, showers with them on. The thing I think is, yeah. is crazier is that he, he, he picked up the shoe and threw it like a ninja star, and it wedged itself in his ass. <laughs> yeah. It hit him in his butt. Toby yeah. Keith would be so proud. He screamed. That seems like a reasonable would... reaction to having a shoe <laughs> ah, thrown into your asshole. <laughs> I went back into my room and locked the door and ah, sat in front of it. The pain. In front of the door. Okay. The door. <laughs> Dude, he's got he's All got, right. And now coming straight to you from the town. Shoe. He's got his shoe up his butt. Yeah. Yeah. Now coming to you straight from the town of Normal, Illinois. It's Normal Pov. Yeah. <laughs> Matt, Matt's, Matt's, Matt's not going to recover. Matt's not going to recover. Matt, Matt, there's so much more to go in this Matt, story, dude. Matt's, the full impact of throwing his shoe in someone's butt has just hit me. Matt, like Matt, Matt's, hit me. Matt's refined sense of humor is really showing through with these butt jokes. <laughs> Shoot what a in the butt from this crowd. <laughs> yeah, pee pee doo doo. <laughs> Maturity. Yeah. No, so normal POV. I can't get over the fact that he threw his shoe and it went into somebody. Like it stuck into them. <laughs> well, you're gonna really like this next part, then, Matt. Mike came into the living room holding his butt. <laughs> what? Yeah. And then Kevin says Please, this. Kevin, give us the line. <laughs> this is Matt's job. Nobody sub in for him. No, I yeah. gotta read here. it. There's some things he's gonna have to do by himself. Here, my cat's here. Maybe she can read it. I'm trying. Oh. All right, kitty, do it. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Mike, your butt's big and it will never be. <laughs> and never will be. So much wrong with that sentence. <laughs> Mike, your Mike, butt's you big are and it never butt will apostrophe be. S big and it will never be. Period. <laughs> and it, yeah. Oh. <laughs> period. Quote, comma. Oh. Kevin smirked. It's he smirked that feet. sentence out. Mike. Yeah, Kevin smirked. I actually, I Mike. hesitate to use the word sentence. <laughs> and then Mike imitated, because that's one too many M's, Kevin's laughing. Yeah. <laughs> Jaden like, j- <laughs> just hit me in the chest and butt with his shoes. <laughs> Why? I scared him. Then don't complain! <laughs> Mia said. <laughs> what was the point of this conversation? All right, oh, we have another POV God. jump. It's like the Westing game. Emily's POV. Yeah, I guess that's me. It's 3.15 yeah. p.m. and Jay hasn't come out of his room since last night. I'm getting nice. worried. Worried. Yeah. yeah. I knocked yeah. on his bedroom door. He threw something at the door. Go away, Mike, before I grab a training stick. Good uh, what use is of that? commas and end quotes <laughs> and training stick. Well, at least he didn't put the stick up his butt. It, I yeah. guess, yeah. <laughs> it's well, Emmy. he's already got a shoe lodged up there. Yeah. yeah. No room. Oh, man. You know what? I might have to change this voice because I think I'm going to lose my, my my ability to speak if I do this for this whole section. Okay, yeah. It's... And then she cleared her throat. We have to read between the lines. <clears throat> <clears throat> it's Emmy. I said, confused. I heard sudden movement. He opened the door. He looked like he had been crying. I went in. He closed the door and tried to hide his tears. Hey, Em. I sat next to him on the bed. I gently touched his cheek. Boink, boink. Yeah. What's wrong, babe? I asked my boyfriend. Oh, I'm getting chipmunk flashbacks. (laughs) (laughs) Holy shit, babe. (laughs) Yeah. Mike scared me. 
Jay's reward. <laughs> Jay's reward. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Jay's mom. Oh, I really like the way you told off Mike, Jay. Yeah. <laughs> he was he was lying. I sent him a look. By airmail. <laughs> Via email. Blow him a kiss, send him a look. Now it's just, yeah. just turning into Mickey Mouse. FedEx. Gosh, darn it. <laughs> Jay, if that was what was really wrong, you would have killed him by now. What is wow. it? Wow! <laughs> really? Silly? What? <laughs> Silly? Oh yeah, I underreacted to getting scared by shoving my shoe up his ass. Hey, guess what? I, I think <laughs> I think the author door. I think the author was so lazy that they couldn't be, be bothered to just retype the sentence. They obviously copied and pasted because same typo. Tear stream dwin his cheeks. <laughs> wow. Or maybe they really think that's how down is spelled. Dwin. It's a it's a it's a long W <laughs> with with an O attachment. Yeah. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah. 9-11. <laughs> Today? <laughs> no. 2001. Can I, oh, just get, no. can I just say, can I just say, I love uh, this conversation. Jay, if that was what was really wrong, you would have killed him by now. What is it? Really? 9-11. Today? No. 2001. And then... What happened then? What? What do you mean, what happened then? <laughs> what? Nothing happened then. Nothing. Obviously, M was the alien transfer student. Didn't you ever watch uh, Power Rangers? Her, she arrived Seriously, here how on do you Earth. Not know? She arrived here on Earth, at, you know, January first, two thousand twelve, and didn't know what everybody was still talking about. Yeah. Oh, Ta- talk about being yeah, out of the line. loop. I'm wow. gonna say this whole oh. line, okay? Yeah, don't okay. interrupt. And I'll try not to cry. There was a tragedy. Millions of people died because of a plane crashing on porpoise <laughs> into one of the tallest oh, bil- wheelings. buildings in New York City. Oh. My mom died there. <laughs> they never rebuilt the buildings, but there's pools where they used to be. <laughs> All right. What? All right. I don't know what's. I don't know what's more ridiculous. I mean, a lot. A, quite a few people did die in 9/11, but millions is a bit of an overestimation. <laughs> Like, that is almost as bad as the chipmunks having billions of fans. Yeah, I was about to say, I'm getting so many chipmunk flashbacks. Yeah, are we sure it's in the what chipmunks do you mean? category? What the fuck do you mean that they never rebuilt the buildings, but there's pools where they yeah. used to be? Yeah, there's sick public pools. What the fuck does that mean? They turned it into public pools, dude. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. like, it's fun to stay at the YMCA, man. <laughs> how does how does this author not like have get nine eleven so bad? You're like, telling do they me even know what's going you're on. You're telling me, crazy Chris, that you and think you other ask, people don't remember nine eleven well enough, so you want to tell them about it. But you and still and do it. it get wrong. it right. You fuck everything up. And by the way, crazy Chris is American, according to their bio. Mm. So. I, I am the real American. <laughs> Millions of if people. You're, if you're you're gonna, if you're gonna pools, write a write a fan fiction pools. In, in remembrance of nine eleven, which you shouldn't. You should get you it should right. Know get the, details the fucking of details right. They're not even really details. <laughs> this is this is a. St- yeah, you should see Every... my you should see my fanfic on the atomic bomb where trillions of people died. Trillions of people died by being every impaled by, by swords. In, in every public school, I know you have to sit there in class and watch another special about. Yeah, every you know, fucking year you hear about this shit. Every yeah. year, it's the reason we're know. at war right now. You should know the bare minimum about it. Well, to be fair, yeah. there, there was that one time I saw that one 9-11 video on YouTube and everyone in the comments were like, they should have sent helicopters in the air to catch people who were falling. So maybe <laughs> yeah. 9-11 just attracts idiots. <laughs> maybe. maybe. <laughs> yeah. And yes, right. that that is true. You can find the video. You find any 9-11 video. It's full of people saying they should have been catching people with helicopters. I don't know why. <laughs> it seems hey, like a good idea on paper. Helicopters. It really yeah. doesn't seem like a good idea on paper. <laughs> I mean, like I think the idea that they put pools where the buildings are. Where the fuck did you hear that? 
<laughs> Where on earth? That's like if I said, oh, after we dropped the nuclear bombs on Japan, Japan disbanded. Or no. Or Where no, the fuck no, did like, you hear that? Like, they yeah. put pools Like, there. Japan just put up a huge nightclub. Yeah. Over top of the, like, like ground zero. But it's like, <laughs> but, but, like, 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 pools... Why yeah, remember, remember, that, remember all that controversy in the news when it's like you won't believe what they're building on 9/11? A pool. Yeah, like- they're putting. Uh, they're put. <laughs> there's a ground zero pool going up, Man. and you know what? They're not even going to have an adult swim time. Damn. His eyes turned red. He's a demon. <laughs> yeah. Like they just. My just eyes turned, are red too. They're glowing red. Yeah. I pulled him closer and held his head on my shoulder, letting him cry. When he stopped, I pulled away, looking into his blue eyes. Honey, <laughs> oh, you're a fucking idiot! You cooled him down so his eyes went from red to blue. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Jay, I'm so sorry. I know it isn't easy to deal with something like that. It is okay to cry. Even if Samin says it isn't. Yeah, fuck Samin. What does she yeah, ever do fuck Samin. Samin. It is. Fuck Samin, Samin doesn't even know that millions of people died in 9-11. It yeah. means you're strong. Sure. <laughs> Thanks, um... Thanks, babe. I feel up to, like, a real Coors Blue right about now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go take a dip in the pool. God. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> the pool babe, where 9-11 used to be. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. Of course. Is that why you stayed in here all day? He nodded. He got a picture from under his pillow and handed it to me. Is that the last time you've seen your mom? He nodded again. Yep. You look so young. I was five at the time. That means he's like seventeen now. I guess. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Look at her butt. Oh. Uh, oh <laughs> my gosh. Yeah. Oh. I yeah. think it's oh my gosh. My gosh. My gosh. Yeah. It's like that no, Usher like, song oh, where he's like, "You make me want to say oh 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 my gosh." <laughs> And then tell me about it. I've prayed that the whole thing was a horrible dream for years, but it wasn't. I just don't wanna accept the fact that it's reality and not dreamality. Yeah, the, Go yeah, fuck the, yourself. The, the, yeah, the, the, one of the many rejected <laughs> finishing moves from Mortal Kombat Three. Dreamality. Yeah. Yeah. Where, where at the end you see, you know, you beat the shit out of them, and then like the camera pans out, and it's actually in a thought cloud, and the both of you have been sleeping the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it was all a dream. It was all a fucking dream. Dreamality. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know how you feel. No, you don't. No, you really don't. <laughs> you really don't. <laughs> don't pull that kind of stuff on me. <laughs> <laughs> Go fuck yourself. You don't know how I feel, and neither do I, because I think millions of people died during 9 11. <laughs> yeah. And, and then they put up pools. Yeah, and then they you put know, up it's, fucking pools. You know, it's so disgusting. I heard at one point they were considering not even letting Muslims enter the pool. Wow. <laughs> Damn. Like it's just the so messed is, up. Or I thought I, I thought I heard they were gonna build a Muslim only pool there. Oh my god. And, uh, luckily, that's why luckily, there's two we pools. All, we, that, all, like, we rode into our There's two know, pools, like one on each top. tower. And it's like <laughs> it's sacred. And they have the jacuzzi where building seven was. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Now I'm wondering, is it a federal crime to pee in those pools? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Yeah, because like he would be peeing on a memorial. Like the FBI just shows yeah. up and just like just t- you do you just disappear. Yeah, yeah. They they pull you under and you never come back up. <laughs> like there's like a little compartment that opens in the side, grabs you by your like grabs you by your junk and Ankle just pulls and just... you away. Yeah. Oh. All right then. Uh, thanks, Emily. I don't know what I do without you. I kissed his cheek. Considering when I need to even get the most basic thing right, I just, like, get it completely wrong. I do not know what I do without you, Emily. Yeah. I'm always here. I'll be there for you. I know. These five words, I swear to you. (laughs) I know. Wait, guys. I know. You know, I guess I'm really upset because I miss her so much, and no knee really cares about 9 11. No knee, no (laughs) knee, no. What are you talking about? And yeah, no one cares. 
What do you mean no one cares about 9 11? <laughs> well, 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 well Emily's <laughs> next line I, might explain this. I've never this heard of it of... until now. <laughs> hey, what's this 9 11? What thing? are you talking about? See, no one really cares because, like, you know, a random ass schmuck hasn't heard of it. No, but, you but know? really, guys. What's this 9-11 thing you keep talking about? I mean, this person wrote a whole fanfiction about it. Apparently millions of people died. I mean, I don't really care. Like, I don't know what this is. Yeah. Here, uh, yeah. oh my gosh. They built pools the... in its place? What the fuck? Who does that? I might Did need to leave. This is pain. Like... Yeah, How dare like... you? Thing happened in like, I don't what know. What do you mean no died. one really cares about 9-11? Well, when 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 someone immediately responds to that with "I've never heard of it until now," I think he has a point. <laughs> this is an alternate dimension where nobody gives a shit about anything. They look, they see that the planes hit the towers and they watch the towers crumble, and they all have a collective, "Huh, huh, huh weird." Uh, yeah, funny. Yeah. yeah. You know what? We're gonna make sure the whole the whole team knows and respects the innocent lives lost. I believe that's how that's pronounced. Oh god. Does no one else know about 9-11? Am I gonna have to tell that to literally everyone else? Well, I'm... don't worry. The next time he tells us about 9-11, he'll use different fucking details. To be, to, oh, okay. to be fair, none of us knew what 9-11 was until we read this story. I knew oh, what yeah, it was. And, and, uh, <laughs> and, so when, and so when he'll tell them about the horrible tragedy of 9-11, then... Michael hide behind Kevin. Oh, right. Also, Bob, we didn't know. We thought we we like apparently millions of people died and they replaced it with swimming pools. Like I didn't know that. I we, mean, I guess I had wrong we, details. Yeah, though. we just yeah. we didn't we truly didn't know. Well, I mean, I mean it's I've never different. even heard of this before. This is my <laughs> yeah. first. You know, it sounds <laughs> kind of dumb. Uh, like a million people, millions of yeah. people apparently died in this. Mm-hmm. What? Serious yeah. business, man. I mean, at least the chipmunks still have billions of fans. Yeah, I mean, they took away, like, one one millionth of the Chipmunks Yeah, one thousandth of the... Chipmunks of the fans right there. Fan base, yeah. <laughs> and now we have Jaden Smith's POV. Yeah, back to Jaden's pop. Yeah. You know, if you pretend this is Jaden Smith, all these insane delusions about swimming pools and millions of lives lost makes a little bit more sense. Everyone, I need to say, Mike, if you ever do that again, <laughs> I will choke the living daylights out of you. How Green Ranger I, or not. What can... on earth? <laughs> Hold on, you walked into the living room to tell him that you would kill him? <laughs> for scaring you earlier? Shut up! Yeah. Who gives a shit about that? Here is Jaden Smith. He's like, how can 9-11 be real? It's like that time... <laughs> if if planes aren't real. It's like the time Matt... Um, yeah, it's like the time Matt like, snuck up on Bob and he was like, boo! And Bob jumped, and then he just pulled out a switchblade, like pressed it against Mike's, <laughs> Matt's throat and was just like, hey man. Yeah, you better think I was twice. just like, I was just yeah. like, don't do that again, or I'll fucking cut you. Yeah. Also, I need to tell you about the Holocaust. <laughs> <laughs> and that's like, I never heard of that. <laughs> What's that? What's that? What's the Holocaust? That's a great Matt impression. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's me. Yeah. yeah. Matt, do your best Matt impression. <laughs> hey guys, it's me. Matt uh, you don't sound win. anything like him. Connor does a better impression. Yeah, Connor does right. a better Matt impression. <laughs> It was just a joke. Dang. Dang. <laughs> you gotta get that appropriate <laughs> response, all yeah. things considered. You yeah, gotta I'm... get that you gotta get that dang G rating. Yeah, I, to yeah. be fair, to be fair, Mike doesn't know anything about 9-11 and doesn't know why this guy's threatening to kill him. So yeah. <laughs> it was just a joke, dang is an appropriate response. Granted, he should know about 9-11. Yeah. And then uh, uh and I, also, I, does anyone know what day it is? September 11th? Kevin, guess. Tuesday? I don't know. <laughs> I don't fucking know. He was right, but didn't know what it represents. Kevin was also born yesterday. <laughs> I <laughs> sighed. September 11th? <laughs> Sorry, should I be using, like, babies? It was just baby. a joke, dang. <laughs> All right, sit the flip down. I'm a school y'all on this important date, okay? Yeah. I can't believe I'm the one that has to do this, but first for everything, I guess. Yeah. An explosion happened on this every day. Happened <laughs> 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 every day. I, I, I uh, I've, I've heard I've heard of train wrecks, but I'm pretty sure this thing derailed in the station. Yep. Yeah. This was a. Yeah, I guess you could call okay. it a plane crash. 
Have you ever seen yeah. the album cover for Mr. Big's Lean Into It? That's what this yeah. is like. This yeah. is this is astonishing. How did you get the first sentence of your explanation so wrong? <laughs> well, I think the it's only not the first thing they the got the only wrong. word that could even remotely be considered accurate in that sentence was like an <laughs> or happened. happened. <laughs> yeah. Conjunction junction. Plane... What's that function? A plane crashed into the tallest buildings in New York City. Two planes. <laughs> Two no, at least buildings. get that right. A plane. <laughs> one single plane crashed into all of the tallest buildings in New York yeah, City. Yeah, yeah. All of them. Six buildings all collapsed at different times. It was like four buildings. And besides, don't make it sound like it happened coincidentally. No, dude, no, okay, so the it's plane like, here's what happened. The one plane, it went through the first building, out the other side, into the second building, out the other side, into the, all the way through, all buildings. six of them, okay? Yeah. And then, it, they collapsed at different times because the first one collapsed, and then the second one collapsed, and then the third one collapsed. Yeah, they know? say... Oh, wait. <laughs> yeah. Read oh. the next sentence. This one's also a very good... <laughs> My died at this exact time as the building she was in collapsed. Wait, so the, the building collapsed and it kill her. She just died. And the yeah. most important word of the sentence is the one you're going to leave out. <laughs> and they were like, my, okay. wait, what'd you say there? Like, who, who died? What? <laughs> People take the day to remember all the innocent lives lost. Some people say that it was an inside job by the president, Ronald Reagan. <laughs> yeah. 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 Ronald McDonald Reagan. Yeah, the president. He at blew the time. up the Empire State Building with his trains. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How many people died? <laughs> oh my God. Mike asked. Very casual. <laughs> and then, even though I said millions earlier, now it's. Almost 3,000 people. No, More no, than 3,000. No, no, that's mathematical yeah. shorthand. That comma stands for... <laughs> like, like you want to know zeros? how many people died during 9-11? I'll, I'll give you credit. Know. I'll give you the slightest bit of credit, Jaden. You got it a little closer when, when you said almost 3,000 than when you said millions earlier today. <laughs> yes. But you're still wrong. How do you get every detail about 9-11 wrong? I How do you do it? I can't believe it. He's Even the ones you get right, you get it. wrong. He changed it to 3,000. That's about as far away from millions as you can get. Well, this is well, why... Well, the... This is why... This is why we need to get blasted with... 9-11 remembrance stuff out there because apparently there's everyone crazy is... Chris is out there who still don't fucking know anything. Well, the thing is, is out there, he still doesn't know what happened in 9-11. Well, the problem I is mean, that he's, like you know, joke... he's just a... Oh, I'm sorry. I said the Never problem mind. is that he's just a 13-year-old kid. He would have done more research, but he heard a rumor that the dark web would find you if you searched for 9-11. No, see, the thing is, uh, we, we, we like to... Within the Steel Donut, we, we sometimes tell a joke or two about how Blake remembers things better than the rest of us, because he has a, a remarkable memory. But it turns out we all have remarkable memories because we remember 9-11 on September 12th. Because everybody else just fucking forgot! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> like, some guy packs up his briefcase and goes to work, and he's like, oh, where, where'd this rubble come from? <laughs> <laughs> or like he's gonna go sit down at his computer and falls face first into a pool and he's like, yeah, how did I get here? I was about to say, he's like sitting on the end of the diving board. Like, I, there used to be a desk here. Yeah, I could have yeah. sworn he's sitting Man. on the end of the diving board. I call in sick like, for hey, one day and now everything's different. <laughs> did they yeah. move the water cooler? <laughs> Lifeguard, lifeguard's like, hey, no Muslims in this pool. <laughs> yeah, but... Get off the diving board. Yeah. He's like, man. Why do we have that no Muslims rule? Any, uh, <laughs> anyways. He's like, didn't you hear? 9 11 happened yesterday. He's like, what's 9 what? 11? I don't know. <laughs> well, let, well, me, let tell me tell you. you. Millions Tens... of people died. No, s <laughs> three people died when, <laughs> yeah. when a paper plane crashed <laughs> into a medium sized building in Boston. From a half a plane. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 22 buildings collapsed at the same eight, eight, time. 
Yeah, eight buildings collapsed at the yeah. same time. I mean, if we're just yeah. allowed to make up details. <laughs> <laughs> I think the only things you've gotten right, completely right, are the date and that it happened in New York City. Although, technically, <laughs> there was also a plane that crashed into the Pentagon and also one that crashed in a field in Pennsylvania, so... Yeah. Whatever. All right, so, Kevin. <laughs> oh, Kevin. With, oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my, oh, my goodness. I think oh, you mean, oh, oh, my oh. goodness. How many people Gene died? Gene Willikers. <laughs> How many people died? Almost 3,000 people. Oh. Oh, oh man, that's, 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 that's dundidly unbelievable. Hmm. <laughs> huh. His eyebrow raises slightly. He's like, yes, hmm. Kevin's just like, oh, 3,000 people died? I'd like to see I some I could have sworn it was please. millions, but, hmm. Yeah. You expect me to believe that 3,000 people just died? Come on. Come yeah. yesterday. And the Mia Farrow coming in. So, that's why you stayed in your room all day? Mia asked. Why I is nodded. so the word of oh, fuck it? And then... I, f- I guess... Who is uh, saying Could that be... That might be Mia again? Uh, Mia that, again? No. That's well, sad. I guess. You stayed in your room all day because some people died? That's so sad. <laughs> yeah. yeah wow, wow what a loser. Get good, scrub. And then Kevin, with the real question. <laughs> yeah, honestly. How did we not know of this? Like, no, really, how? Did we not know of this? How? How could this happen? How could this happen? Yeah. Kevin asked. I shrugged. Ah. I, I I don't know. Oh, I don't know either. I really don't. <laughs> I really don't. <laughs> I thought this was common knowledge. I, everyone... I'm sorry. We thought everyone needed to know of 9-11. Very few people respect the innocent lives lost or the day. I think the, I, I think the lives lost are, are, are the reason why we mourn the day. No, yeah. dude, no one remembers the lives lost or the day. They don't remember the day. It's 9/11. Which is a big blank spot on anything. the calendar. Yeah, it gets. Does it jump a number? Does it go like, from ten to twelve what, here? Like, is, is, am I seeing something wrong? I'm about to have an aneurysm. <laughs> I'm about to break. I'm very mad. <laughs> yeah. And think, I'm not Bob, sure my face is capable types. of expressing how angry I am. Cut, think man. of happier times, man. Cut my life I can't into think pieces. of any happier times. <laughs> this oh, is my last is week. All I remember is the last five minutes and 9-11. The last five minutes and 9-11. A, a memoir. Yeah. Well, by, at least you remember by it. Bob. I guess that's a positive. Sort of. All right, and, then, and then Mia comes in with this. Yeah. We do. No one deserves to die that way. Not even the worst criminals. I like I like that you if she hadn't don't. taken that position, the assumption would have been that we'd take the worst criminals and put stop them in like, buildings. executing them. We'd just put them into planes and launch them at buildings. Or we'd put them in the buildings yeah, and then we'd... hit the plane. Buildings hit the buildings oh, yeah. with planes. Because no yeah. one deserves to put them in a right? high rise sized prison and then we'd fly a plane straight in. And then it. we have this like rather disturbing just musing on better ways to die. Yeah. <laughs> Let's list off a few. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'd rather have my head chopped off. At least it would be quick and oomps painless. Oomps. <laughs> yeah, when I you gotta that save that single thing. syllable. It's also nice that that happens to be the halal way to kill someone. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. Tell me about it. <laughs> G said. God. He's a real G. <laughs> All remember this day forever. I said. Evreen nodded in agreement. You oh, yeah, didn't Evreen. even mention your mother, you fucking <laughs> This one shot is dedicated to 9-11 and the innocent lives lost on that day in 2001. We watched a video in the second grade, I guess. Second to last period today at school <laughs> and I nearly cried. It's so sad. Cry face! How did you watch a video the same day you wrote this and still fuck it up? Cry face! Yeah, cry face. Right, you know what? You know, let's cap off. Let's cap off our story of remembrance of of one of, you know, the worst days in American history. Did a while. Yeah, with just a fucking emoticon. Oh, I thought you were saying nine <laughs> eleven can of the be story. expressed through sad faces. Oh yeah, here's a review that's an emoticon. Wink face. Sad wink face. Uh, oh, Jesus. 
There's eight reviews. I don't know if Bob's coming back, so let's just jump on these. Um, well, here. Let's start from the top. Yeah. No, uh, no review here, here, blah, blah, blah. Uh-huh. Let's go for the good yeah. ones. Imaginalized Production says, I'm not really a Jim Lee fan, but I really like this, the fabulous work. Yeah, the romance was the focus there. You know, I, I, wanted, I wanted to remember 9-11, but the pairing just kind of, mm, I couldn't get behind it. Yeah. Stay banned, wearing them Ray-Bans. I can yeah. truly, I can I can truly understand, understand you. you. You complete me. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, yeah, it's too uh, sad. Ill, watch this video. Keep it up. We better not forget the innocent people. What video? Just... <sighs> get, look at this guy's chapter you. two. I need chapter more. Two. Yeah, I need more. I need this guy explaining every single disaster. This, oh, the Scarlet Ranger says... I noticed that there wasn't anything on TV to remind people of the day like they did in the past. It's like after the 10-year mark, they forget, but I like to think when the 100-year anniversary comes around, there will be great remembrance, like when the 100-year anniversary of the Titanic came around. Yeah, that was great. Hopefully she's saying that because she realizes that dumb fucks like Crazy Chris already can't get their facts straight. And then we have Hard Rhyme Dropper, Miss DJ Classy B. She says, Damn. many people know about it at my school, even my generation. That was about three years old at the time and barely remember anything. But the teachers never said anything about it, probably because of the many stories we already heard in middle school. I remember my seventh grade teacher playing a video on it, but I didn't watch it because I knew it would start up my panic attacks. Yeah. Wow. Maybe. Wow, what a bitch. Oh. <laughs> triggered by 9-11. <laughs> well, I mean, out of all the things to be triggered by, I feel like 9 is at least a somewhat appropriate Yeah, thing. okay. Yeah. Although she didn't have, uh, although it, uh, she was three years old at Hopefully the time. Hopefully you at least read, like, a news article or something, and you didn't just turn your fucking blinders on or something. Yeah, I mean, considering it apparently has no connection to you, you were just three years old at the time, probably shouldn't be that bothered. Well, you should be bothered, oh, yeah. but you should be willing to confront it. Yeah, I didn't mean yeah, to disrespect. I started keep myself unknown. sane, you know? Rip the, to the innocent that died. Sigh. Anyways, beautiful story. Very nice. All of you are wrong, oh, yeah. and you beautiful. should feel bad for liking this. That's one this. word for it. Mm, right, you know what? I'm I'd like to say more. I'd like to say more, but I'm done. I'm out of here. Goodbye. Yeah. I know YouTube did that whole, like, you know, recent, like, terms of service thingy where everyone got up in arms, and, you know, I know we're kind of negative, so, you know, whatever, we might be affected. But fuck you, Crazy Chris. <laughs> I, yeah, I mean, I, I, we don't usually cuss out authors, but... I don't think we'll be affected by the YouTube Terms of Service. Do, but any, I will, do any research. But even if we were, fuck you, Crazy Chris. Yeah. And fuck you every single other person who thinks it's okay to write a fucking 9-11 story. Rip and yeah. peace, Spider-Man at 9-11. <laughs> I just came back to say that. Alright. Well. Thanks for watching. <laughs>